World Health Organization don't name coronavirus disease COVID-19. Supreme Court now don't confirm it the election of David Leon as Bayelsa State Governor elect. And we ask the APC don't form 12th Man Reconciliation Committee. And they don't bury the seminary away kidnappers kill for inside Kaduna State. Good afternoon and welcome to Wazubia Max TV. This now as it take happen. My name now Adati Awunkwe. For inside the first story where we carry come, World Health Organization. On Tuesday, they don't announce the COVID-19. Now it will be the official name of the badness virus from China. As a matter be, then talk say the disease now threat for the world, but say chances day to stop them. On top of that matter, Chief of World Health Organization, that's not Tedros at Hanum, Gabriel Yesu, now in tell to people for inside Geneva, say CO stand for Corona, YV na virus, then the D way they did na for disease, why the 19, na for the year, sake of say na for December 31st, 2019, now they discover the virus. Oga Tedros talks say them choose the name now to avoid to the call name of places, plus including animal or even group of people. The virus don't kill more than 1,000 people and it don't infect over 42,000 people can still enter inside 25 countries. And sharply for inside the next to re as the hold. Justice Joma Ojuko of Federal High Court now for inside Abuja being fined Obunge government 200,000 naira to pay Omoe Le Shore and Olawale Bakere as them start the hearing of the case of the crime against the government plus including the country where be say day against Shore and Bakere on Wednesday. Justice Ojuko being squeezed face on top of the one where be say the trial don't delay. Then be fined government can shift the matter go Thursday, February 13th. The lawyer of Shore being yarn with story people after after the court session. And still on top of the matter, Noble Loretta Webby, Wale showing couples, including Senator She Husani, they been come court for Omoe Le Shore and Olawale Bakari. Our Wazobia Max TV to reperson, Akimbola Abayomi, he did there and he go bring us story of everything where they happened there. It be like say we will come back to Abayomi later. Make we sharply enter inside the next story where we carry come. Supreme Court now don't confirm say David Leon Naim be the candidate of APC and governor-elect of Bayelsa State. On Tuesday, the five-man panel of Apex Court now being agreed on top of the one where be say the Court of Appeal yan say the matter where Senator Hennikin Lopobiri been carry come say where they squeeze face for the September 4th, 2019 primary election where APC do. Say him no carry and come on time. For the judgment now with Justice Iyang Okoro read, the panel now talks say the matter where him carry come no get weight at all at all. Look, we very been the talk say Apex make Apex court declare him as candidate of the party and governor elect. Him they talk say the governorship primary election where be say them do for inside APC for Bayelsa State. Say them no do am according by the law where they guide APC. So therefore, the party no get any candidate at all. And for inside another story, civil society legislative advocacy center, they do meeting with them titled Exploring New Frontiers in Nigeria's Anti-Money Laundry Regime Through Effective Use of Data. As the matter be that they do the meeting for the and our Tory person will be Solomon. He will carry the Tory can give us later on today. Sharply for inside another Tory, APC on Tuesday don't form 12th member National Reconciliation Committee and are the first national chairman of the party and the before governor of Oshun State, that Nabisi Akande, Naim be the head of the committee. We see here in Senator John Enno, Naim go be the secretary of the committee. As they are now for inside the inauguration, the national secretary of the party on Tuesday evening and APC national chairman, that's now Adam Sushumule, it a ginger the community, say, make them no feel President Muhammadu Bari for inside the party. And still on top of the matter as they yearn for there, the chairman of the committee will be BC Akande, even give better promises the committee no go fail at all at all. This committee now will be said them for now to settle all the plenty quarrel where they happen for APC for inside the country to bring the party members together. And for inside the next story, 
PDP leaders now on Tuesday being Wakago European Union office, plus including French Embassy, plus United Nations office for inside Abuja, to call for help now make the help to address matter where they affect the democracy of the country. This is now the second protest with PDP they do to tell the international community now to come help Nigeria on top matter of say our democracy don't they die. As in the young gift to real people, the deputy national chairman of PDP for Inside North, that Nassimito Suleiman Nazif, he talks say things go better when international communities worry the leadership of the country well well. No longer listen to anybody. And that is why the People's Democratic Party decided to reach out to international community to lay complaints with respect to electoral act that has not been assented to up till now. This is five years on the inception of this administration. And we are aware of the systematic collapse in our electoral processes, the way elections have been conducted in Kogi. We saw what transpired in the last elections. We are not happy with what has transpired. Nigerians have seen for themselves what the opposition party is going through. We saw what happened in Bayelsa. We saw what happened in Imo. And with Imo, it's with respect to the Supreme Court judgment and uh, we are calling on a review of that judgment. And still on top of the matter, the National Secretary of the Party, that's Nakawu Baraje, he the young say democracy for inside the country no get level again. And apart from media plus including international community, that's now why they, they call international community to come help us. Democracy in Nigeria has been built on five pillars. One is you, the media. Two, is the election umpire, that's INEC. Three, the security agencies. Four, the judiciary. Five, the international community. These are the pillars that support uh, democracy in Nigeria. Now, if one of these pillars collapses, democracy will drill on that side. Out of the five, only two are left. Uh, election umpire is compromised, you all know it. Uh, security agencies are part and parcel of APC government. Judiciary is being threatened. And no, no, nobody has any confidence in judiciary now again. The only one that's left now is the media, that's you, and the international community. For inside the next story where we carry come, Percy B say they prepare to become father where they, they call seminarian for the Good Shepherd Catholic Major Seminary, where they for inside Kaduna State, Michael Nadina in name, where B say kidnappers been carried, come later kill him. We ain't say they don't bury him on Tuesday. As a matter be friends and family plus including in colleagues now, they know if he stop to cry, as they bury him for where they bury people inside the school. As a matter be for the burial mass where BC them do, Bishop of Sokoto Diocese, that na Matthew Kuka, and the Bishop of Kaduna Diocese, Most Reverend Matthew Ndagoso, they be show face for dear. Bishop Kuka talks, they make all Christians now keep their faith alive, even with all the things where BC they happen. If see they call on the government, they may then look for ways to take tackle matter of security inside the country, instead of to they blame people. And still on top of the matter, the Bishop of Kaduna Diocese, he say, the way where security matter before we country, say no be better sign at all at all. On top of this matter, Nadi and three other seminarians now where kidnap has been carried. They be kidnapped them for their hostel on January 10th, 2020. And they can't carry them go somewhere where be say nobody know. Them release the three other then release the three other people, but Nadi no been day lucky. They can't kill them. Then later can't find a dead body for inside the Kaduna Abuja Highway on February 2nd. And we come out from inside that bad story, enter for another one. Public schools now for inside FCT, they beg FCT administration to come put eye on top the bad condition where we say school buildings just day, plus to help them to get more teachers. Some of these schools now where we say Wazobia Max TV been go visit, it really shows say some schools never benefit from the school renovation project where FCT Minister of State, Dr. Ramatu Aliyu, just start. Even with better building self, some schools see they cry out the young they need more teachers to come help them. Our Wazobia Max TV to repair will be John Emmanuel. Now you go complete this story. Heavy wind been scattered the roof of this classroom during the time we rain the fall for inside last year. 
And the school management talks say, them don't they beg the FCT authority, make them help them repair the roof of this classroom so that school children go fit learn for better environment. Blow our roof away since last year. It has not been repaired, so we need the aid of government. Let them come and help us to put it back. I'm waiting to spoil my mind where I know they're happy at all with Nadia classroom. Where rain come out since last year. And up till now, they never repaired the classroom. You can see, ask your cameraman to go and take that picture of that building. It's not good. How can we have this kind of classroom inside Abuja? Inside, we say, Abba, it is not good. It's not good for anybody. This is not a conducive environment for learning. Pilot Science Primary School will be one of the Obonga schools where we see an FCT administration they operate, get some Kaja teaching materials where make them different from other LEA primary schools for inside FCT. That is the reason why they call us pilots. We are unique. You can see our children, we do allow them to, to be playing uh, rough like other school children. We give, we educate them on, we teach them the way to behave well, morally. We call PTA, we tell their parents that we don't want such children that uh, maybe used to go up and down. Some of them, they used to go walk around. We don't raise those such children. Here, we raise reasonable and talented children here. All our children that are here, they are good. God is helping us. Even the teachers, they are trying their best. But just like other schools for inside FCT, the schools still get some problems where them they beg government to come help them solve so that they go fit maintain the standard where government use establish them. We are in need of teachers. We don't have enough teachers. There are some classes, in fact, if you enter, we merge some classes together. Uh, in our office, they promise us that they will send us teachers. Up till now, they have not sent any. Most of the government schools for inside FCT know they as lucky as this one because of the kind learning materials we then get. Of our school was more than primary school. The school, the school has a smart class made by the SDG, and the the SDG have improved. The smart class have improved the students in learning, and we are thankful to the SDG. Our teachers are well educated. They teach with good understanding. I think that the government should go out there. Tell all the uneducated children to come to school and learn. And when all the schools, I make all the schools developed so that it's not only one school that is developed. And because of that, it will make sense, say, the renovation of government schools where the FCT Minister of State, Dr. Ramatu Aliu, been started recently, reached all of them. This now, John Emmanuel for Wazubia Max TV. And for inside the next story, we say for National Assembly on Tuesday, they be shift their meeting go Wednesday to honor late Senator Ignatius Long Jam, where he say die on Monday. Senate leader that's Naya Abdullah, they talk, they tell the they talk say the death of the Senate Senator Long Jam, where they represent Plateau South, send a big loss now may be for inside Nigeria. Deputy Senate President that now of your Omo Agege, where being held their meeting, come they talk now they tell the family plus including government and people of Plateau State, plenty sorry and do for this one will be say it just happened. Also for inside House of Representatives, the Speaker Femi Gwajabi Amelia where they held their meeting there, he still they tell the family members of late Senator Long Jam, Bele and Ndu. As matters to be, we hear the Senate for inside their next meeting. Go do goodbye meeting for Senator Benjamin Owajumogu, where B.C. died on the 19th of December 2019. Now, all the story where we carry come, but we still get two more to read to give you gist on. No go anywhere, make we bring you business and sports story. <music> For inside business, they don't give a bonge government sense talk to develop policies and law where we say it will help to protect the important information where oil and gas industry get, sake of cyber attack. 
the technical assistant for gas business and policy, to the Minister of State for Petroleum Resources, that not Justice, Derry Faka. Now, in the talk this one now on Tuesday, during the 2020 edition of Nigeria International Petroleum Summit, where they hold for inside Abuja. For inside the meeting, then talks they make policymakers now respond to different Wahala where we say a day to manage emissions plus including to invest on top infrastructure. That's not business story. Make a check within the for sports. <laughs> And inside sports, Manchester United manager, that's now Ole Gunnar Solskjaer, he talked now, say, Odion Igalo now go day for the squad for the Premier League where he said they go play on Monday for inside Chelsea. Igalo be missed the club training camp inside Spain, sick of the fear of coronavirus, where he say, now waiting for me can now no enter back to the UK. And still on top of the matter, remember, say, Igalo been joined United on top loan from Shenkai Shenhua on 31st January. Oga Social now they talk say he wants to make a gallo day the squad sharp sharp, sick of saying they desperate to play for Man United. Now auditory where we carry come be this for this afternoon. But before we go, make I say remind you of all our top to read them. We've been tell you say World Health Organization don't name coronavirus disease as COVID-19. And Supreme Court now don't confirm it, the election of David Leon as Bayelsa state governor elect. APC don't form 12 man reconciliation committee. And for the last one, they don't bury the seminarian where kidnapper has been killed for Kaduna State. Now, Wazobia Max TV9 we still day on top. And as it takes happen, now just tell you so. My name is Adati Komupi. Good afternoon. To enjoy more of this, our will get videos when you just watch. Press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.